My name's El Capitano and this is Saigon. Tonight, having lived here for five years, we wanted to bring you back to Taudien to a new feature called the Beer Hall. Now this place is owned and operated by a guy called Till, who about four or five years ago brought German beer to the city. Originally he went to a place called Govat, which is on the northern side of the city. He was laughed at, people joked, no one's ever gonna want German beer. He proved them all wrong, opened up a banging venue, and now he's brought that concept to the heart of Taudien. Now, one of the greatest things about living in Vietnam, especially in Saigon right now, it's become a massive melting pot for all sorts of foods and people. We got new businesses entering into the city and now they want a taste of the whole of Asia. And this place has probably nailed it. They have got Singaporean, Taiwanese, Italian kebabs, and even Indian food all in one venue. We're gonna go and have a look inside to see what tasty treats they've got in store. Now this place is a beer hall and what they've done is they've imported all their hops and yeast all the way from Germany to give you that classic steiny taste of beer. They also serve it in one litres for about 70,000 a bit. But we're here to talk about the food. To our right and left we're starting up with that traditional Vietnamese barbecue serving fresh seafood barbecued on the grill and it tastes absolutely off the charts. On our left we're now up to the French shop called Le Petit Louis. These guys are doing those French classics from the Cassolets and the bacon and cheddar quiches. To our right, we're moving up to Thailand where you might be able to get one of the best pad thais anywhere in the city. Moving to the left, we've got Oliver's Pizza serving that almost authentic pillar style of Italian pizza, slightly thicker ciabatta bread. Now to our left, if you're in a hurry for a curry, we have got hurry for a curry, serving amazing, authentic, northern and southern style Indian food. To our right hand side, Eat Lara is back, who have down just $4 old, but they've got a new store selling that Singaporean street food specialities. Next up, we've got S Tacos, bringing that authentic Mexican taco flavor right here to Taudien. Goat Father are over here to the right hand side with probably the best logo here in the beer hall but they're serving that kind of Indonesian kind of fare. Goat, beef, chicken, all lovely marinated, all filling and cheap as chips. Next up we've got the Shawarma Shack. Now this is owned and run by Rasha. We've actually had her as a guest host before. She has wraps and kebabs just down the road in Taudien but she's come up here to combine that with some great German beer. And last but not least, for people like me who really like their meat, we've come to the grill. They're importing US star steaks, whacking it onto a grill and giving that true American meaty flavor. And behind me tonight, they have the German Business Association. They've got a big gear, all the German businesses come to one place. And if you've got a big party, two to 300 people plus, I think the whole place fits about 1500. You can come down, book this private area, grab a band and get your party on. Now to me, after five years living here, the beer hall is what I love about Vietnam. We've got decent priced beer, 70,000, 60,000 for a big leader. We have all the foods of Asia and the world in one place and that melting pot of cultures. We've got people from all over the world, whether you're Asian, Western, Northern or Southern from the world, this is a place to come, drink, be merry and get well fed. We hope you've enjoyed it tonight and we look forward to seeing you on the next episode of This Is Saigon.